One of the most frustrating issues that one might experience in gaming is random or persistent lag and stuttering. If Elden Ring keeps lagging or stuttering on you and you have no idea how to deal with it, you're in luck. Check out this video on what you need to do to fix these issues. By the way, please like and share our videos to help those who has the same issue so that we can help them too. Once you're done, let's begin. Fix 1. Check the game's system requirements. If you're running an old PC, or if your computer barely meets the minimum system requirements of the game, it may encounter difficulty running Elden Ring, especially if it's burdened by other running applications in the background. For both minimum and recommended specifications of Elden Ring, visit the official Steam website. Fix 2. Restart your PC. Refreshing your PC by doing a simple reboot can sometimes eliminate lag or micro stuttering. Such issues may occur occasionally if the system is left running for an extended period. This simple but sometimes effective procedure is a go-to fix for folks who occasionally experience sudden and inexplicable game crashes and random lagging issues. <music> fix 3. Install updates for your graphics drivers. The other key step is to ensure that your PC is running the most recent version of graphics drivers. Drivers that are out of current or corrupted can cause a variety of difficulties, including poor performance, crashes, and unpredictable disconnections. <laughs> Fix 4. Roll back the GPU drivers. Occasionally, the updated driver may actually be problematic and lead to gaming problems. If upgrading the driver did not solve the problem, or if the problem reappeared after that, try rolling back the driver. Some users may not be able to roll back the driver. In any of these situations, you can try to download the old driver from the manufacturer's website and then do a clean install. Fix 5. Use lower graphics settings. One of the ways to fix stuttering issues due to weak hardware is by tweaking the graphics settings of the game you're playing. If you're playing Elden Ring on a PC that's not intended for gaming or has less than ideal components for gaming, using lower graphics settings may help boost performance and eliminate stuttering or lagging. Fix 6. Verify integrity of game files. FPS, drop, stuttering, and lagging issues are sometimes indications of damaged or corrupted game files. You can utilize the Steam Client option in validating file integrity to confirm that the Elden Ring game files are up to date. Fix 7. Use Hardware Accelerated GPU Scheduling. Hardware Accelerated GPU Scheduling is a Windows feature designed to boost performance of a computer. This feature has a mixed reaction from users over the years, so turning it on depends on the result on your PC. Enabling this feature can be a recommended troubleshooting step if you're running out of options. <music> Fix 8. Disable Windows Game Bar. Some Elden Ring players have experienced FPS drops, stuttering and lagging when the Windows Game Bar is enabled. Windows Game Bar is a Windows 10 and 11 feature that users can use to access shortcuts for gaming features such as making screenshots, recording gameplays, or the screen, as well as game DVR settings. Try turning off this feature and see if that will fix Elden Ring stuttering issues. Fix 9. Disable overlays. Some Elden Ring players have noticed that certain overlays causes issues with their game. While there's no definitive list of what these overlays are, some of the common software devices have been known to cause performance issues when gaming. <music> Fix 10. Increase game priority. Another basic way to give your PC a little boost in terms of FPS and performance is by giving the game higher priority. Here's what you need to do. Fix 11. Avoid overclocking. Some gamers have reported that deactivating overclocking has resolved the problems in Elden Ring. If the game still crashes after reinstalling it, 
check to see if the problem is caused by your overclocking program or overclocked hardware. This approach is obviously only applicable if you are overclocking your machine. If you're not doing it, simply disregard this one. Fix 12. Update Windows Operating System. Before doing any advanced troubleshooting, you also want to ensure that you have the latest Windows version available for you. That's it. If you think that this video is helpful, we would appreciate it. If you can leave a like or comment, subscribe to our channel or share it to your friends. This can greatly help in making Google's algorithm can find and recommend this to others.